Hi everybody, welcome back to my 100% walkthrough of Assassin's Creed Odyssey. On this video we are going to be doing the next mission in the episode 3 of the first of the Fate of Atlantis. This is called Deadly Little Secrets. Okay, and we'll find it over here. We're still looking for that young boy's mum and dad. And uh, so we're going to jump off of the Temple of Logic and we'll make our way there. I'll spin up the video, but it's not really very far at all. I'm going to run around the horse with that. And then jump down into this garden area here and into this doorway. A lot of this is actually talking. We'll see a new character, this quite looks simply. Like the perfect place to hide missing humans. Locked. But I think I know what opens this. More complicated the key, the bigger the secret. Okay, so once we get inside the doorway, we've got to make our way. In a, there's a big room with a lot of bad guys in it, and you can fight them if you want, but there is no um, need because it, this is not a location where you have to complete anything to it, and there's a much easier way of dealing with this rather than fight all those bad guys. If you go over to one of the sides, either side will do, Someone but I went really to this side. We're going to climb up here. Um, I went too far because if you go up that side bit there, you'll see that's the entrance. I'm just passing it, but I went up right out of the top of the roof, which wasn't necessarily what I wanted to do. But hey, that's what we did. What I did. And then you drop down here, and then you can make your way across the roof of the building, jump across to this block. Now we're going to meet a character here in a moment who we have met before. I don't know if you remember him, he's from older games though. We haven't met him before in this game, but we've met him before in other games. In fact, we see a glimpse of another of two characters that we've we've seen before. Okay, so there are Isu about down the bottom there. Now, as long as that one is looking out the window that way, believe it or not, you can assassinate this right, and he doesn't turn around, but the other one might. So Rather than have them look for you, run. Just keep going until you get to where the marker is and then you will get a scene. That will put an end to all of that. said that? Show yourself! My name is Aita. I am a scientist, and in many ways, these are my children. You created the Minotaur? The Cyclops? The Writhing Dread? They're monsters! Are we not all monsters? Imperfect beings striving towards our ultimate potential. Is that not why you are here? I'm here because a little boy's parents are missing. And all signs point to you. How very human of you. Oh. Okay, so we've got to go look for Aita. Aita, by the way, just in case you have forgotten, spoiler alert, so pause it if you don't want to know, but in Black Flag and in Unity, there was a sage, if you remember, 
and that sage was the husband of Juno. Well, that is Aita. Don't bother trying to fight those guys off. Literally, just run away, and you'll be fine. We're here. Please help us. The Castis, you're here. Lyra, what are we doing here? They came for me in the night. I'll never be safe. Don't worry, I'm getting everyone out of here. Didn't anyone teach you it's cruel to lie? What? What's cruel is abducting and experimenting on these people. Without sacrifice, there can be no progress. Without experimentation, there can be no perfection. You're breaking Poseidon's law. I am advancing knowledge for the betterment of Atlantis. Poseidon's lack of vision keeps us in darkness. But we are close. So very close. Humans are not animals to be caged and tortured. We created them to serve us. That is their sole purpose. Let these people go. It's too late for them. Project Olympos has already begun. One human escaped before the transformation was complete, and lives were lost. This won't happen again. Surely you understand. So, you've seen the beast she becomes. I'm getting these people out of here. But, don't you want to know what's behind this door? I won't play your little games. I'm getting these people out of here. So, you would choose to let your small-minded morality hinder your progress? What if I just killed you, set these people free, and broke through your stupid door? <laughs> you can't kill me, Alexios. I can see you're struggling. What if I told you the greatest achievement in Atlantis is behind that door? And that we owe that achievement to you? What are you talking about? Through there is a path to immortality. For you. For us. Embrace your legacy. Forget these miserable humans. Abandon morality and the answers to all your questions are just beyond that door. Please! Save us or we'll die! You will be reborn! Don't you want to know why you're really here? Free the people and this door will remain closed to you forever. Pass through, however, and it will lock behind you. These rats will be mine. What will it be, the Gustis? Their lives? Or your destiny? Fuck your door. I promised a little boy I'd bring his parents home. And that's exactly what I'm going to do. Ah, <sighs> very disappointing. No matter. If there are two things Atlantis has in ample supply, it is adamant and humans. Come on, let's get out of here. Thank you, the Castis. I'll get to see Alcon again. Hurry. Tell your son if Inisu ever calls him a rat again, Vicastis Alexios will deal with them personally. Poseidon lied to me. They've been experimenting on humans this whole time. And that's the end of this mission. Uh, there's another ending to that, and if you want to try that out, then feel free to. So, but thanks very much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe till next time. Bye for now.